All right, guys, so today we have another unboxing. This right here is from Grizzly Geckos, G-R-I-Z-Z-L-Y, Geckos on Instagram. Give him a follow. Um, Nico has been probably, like, one of the people that I get pretty much most of my information from. There's two main people that I will reach out to if I have questions or need some advice. Uh, and he is one of them. He's been... Uh, in, you know, reptiles for, I think he said it was like 16 or 17 years that he's been breeding uh, or keeping gargoyles. So he's someone that has a wealth of knowledge, even though his Instagram isn't, you know, flooded every day with like new pic pictures and that type of stuff. Don't sleep on it. He still breeds a ton of animals, ton of different species, and he has some really quality uh, gargoyles as well so i definitely recommend giving him a follow he's up in canada so that's where this uh, girl right here that's where she came from uh, so yeah i'm just gonna get right into it uh, and ignore all that stuff i'm in the middle of uh building a desk so that's why it's all that stuff back there but anyways yeah so he actually reached out to me about this girl because he knew i was in a search and I've talked to him for a little while now and uh, built up a relationship with him. And guys, that's what I got to say is one of the most important things is building relationships with people because not only are they going to be there for you when you need advice, but also if you want some you know, nicer animals or just an animal from them, you know, it's honestly a lot easier to sell something that you love to someone that you know you can trust. So that's an important thing is, you know, making sure that you use the social media to your advantage when it comes to reptiles. And this just isn't, you know, for gargoyles. This is anything. Build a relationship with people. You can find out most of the time they're willing to help you as long as you're respectful, you know, and, and you're a decent person. And you do what's right for the animals. People are willing to help you. Uh, but also, that's honestly how I get most of my geckos. Is from people I have relationships with. That know that they can trust me with their nicer animals. That they aren't just going to throw up you know, for sale on their page or some something like that. So that's how I've gotten a few of the nicer animals that I have. Is just direct contact with some breeders that... They know they could trust me. I'm always respectful to them. I'm always grateful for their information. Um, so yeah, that's something important to do if you guys want, you know, better quality uh, animals, or you just want to be able to have someone reliable that you could reach out to for any advice. So this girl right here, she is going to be part of my blotch group. So that's blood splatter. And Dexter. Dexter is a male. Blood Spatter is another female. And this girl is a female as well. So the uh, the lighting kind of sucks in here. But you can see she has a ton of color on her. She's been basically in shipping for two days now. So uh, I don't want to keep her out too long. I want to make sure she gets hydrated. She gets fed. She goes back into her enclosure. Oops. But yeah, oh, she's already running. Hold on. I don't want to take her outside in the light or anything. I just want to let her chill. But anyways, it's just a chase. So, um, yeah, this girl, I don't have a name or anything for her yet she's probably a little over 20 grams right now but she's really cool I like the little color that she has on her nose there um and i really like the pattern on her back so um guys if you want to get updates of her and how she's doing and everything just give me a follow on my instagram at red rag but a huge shout out to nico at grizzly geckos for this girl um he has a ton of amazing quality gargs so I definitely suggest you guys give him a follow. Um, and he has a wealth of knowledge as well. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. This is the newest edition. 
and hopefully she will be breeding by 2022 so next year um but yeah like i said if you want to get updates and everything of her just make sure you follow me on my ig but thanks again guys i'm gonna go let her rest up uh get hydrated get some food that's an important thing when you get them and not mess with them too much so thanks for watching